Hey guys, so most of you probably know this, some of you may not, but besides making videos, my real job for the past year has been working at YouTube. Yes, the website all around us. They're based in San Bruno, California, which is a bit south of San Francisco. My job was a visual designer, so I would work on creator-facing pages like upload and annotations and video manager, and I would mock up in Photoshop what the pages should look like so that the engineers could actually build them. However, this past Friday was my last day. I wasn't fired it was my choice to leave, and I prefer to say leave rather than quit because it doesn't really feel like quitting. This was my first job out of college, and I tried it for a year, but working for such a big company just isn't what I want to be doing right now. Don't get me wrong, there were some parts of the job that were amazing. YouTube is owned by Google, so we got all of the same perks. The private shuttles with embroidered seats, the treadmill desk, the slide, the food. Oh god, the food was so good. But none of that really means anything if you don't don't like your job. I didn't like never feeling like I owned anything that I worked on. I didn't like how long it would take to launch anything since there are so many levels of management to work through. And mostly, I just didn't want to be sitting on a computer staring at Photoshop all day with no real end goals in sight. I want to spend my time making videos, editing, doing freelance work that may include some web design, but also includes poster design, t-shirts, books. I'd love to work on a web series doing props or set design or write a book or design a crazy sculpture. I just didn't feel like I had time to explore any of that while working a 40 hour a week job and also trying to maintain this channel. I'm realizing that I care more about what's inside the player than around it. So I'm just really excited to move back into being a full-time creator of web video, rather than being on the outside, just building the tools to support it. You know, when I got this job a year ago, everyone was like, that's so awesome that you got your dream job right out of college. But working for YouTube was never my dream job. I just kind of fell into it. I'm really grateful that I did, because I've learned a lot. But this is my dream job. Getting to spend my time making videos and doing design work for other YouTubers and projects I really believe in. I don't want to spend the next 10 years of my life working my way up in a company like Google. I want to be at the forefront of building the next Google. And I mean, I'm only 21 years old, my only real expenses are food and rent, so if there's a time to take a risk and go after it, it's right now. So what am I going to be doing now? Between 8 hours a day working and 2 hours a day commuting, that's a lot of time I need to fill. Well, I'm hoping to split my time about 50-50 between making videos and doing freelance design work. I'm going to try to up my schedule to 2 videos a week, so there will be more graphic design videos, more craft videos, and whatever else you guys want to see. Let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions for topics you want to hear me talk about. And I'm also happy to announce that I am signing my channel with the network Big Frame, who also represent Mr. Guitar Man, Day Storm, Dave Days, so they'll be helping me to grow this channel even further. And the other side of what I'll be doing is freelance graphic design work. I've been doing some over the past year, like the Tour de Nerd Fighting poster or the box set of John Green's books, but now I'll have a lot more time to fill with a lot more projects. So feel free to send me an email at karencavitt at gmail.com if you want to talk about working together on any of your upcoming design projects. I know some of you guys probably think I'm crazy for walking away from such a secure, high-paying job in this economy. I keep going back and forth myself. One minute I'm like, this is awesome, I'm gonna finally have time to work on all these projects. And the next minute I'm like, did I just make the biggest mistake of my life? So if you want to do your part in helping me succeed over the next few months, please just share my videos with your friends or anyone who you think might like them. One more thing, do you want to know a fun fact? The whole time I was working at YouTube, I had a framed map from the first Tour de Nerdfighting and a photo from the first VidCon on my desk, just as a constant reminder of the community and the people that we were designing the site for. I know YouTube gets a lot of flack for constantly changing everything and seeming like they don't care about the small channels, but I've been on the inside, and trust me, they really do have your best interests at heart, and they're just trying to do what's best for the site as a whole. So thank you so much for watching my videos and always being so supportive. It's taken a while, but I'm finally realizing that maybe I can succeed doing this full time. Maybe I don't need a safety net of school or an internship or a full time job right now. I just hope you guys will stick around in the future so we can find out together. Thanks so much for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe, and I will see you all in just a couple days.